Okay, this is on the Moore job, number 53121, installed by Stetson. Okay, we are just adding a condensing unit to the existing furnace and existing coil. The existing coil already has a TXV. Okay, um, the owner wants the AC set somewhere else than the scope says. So, um, let's look here. On the east side of the house, they want the AC set right here, in this corner here. Okay, you will run a new line set, and the line set will come out, um, well, watch this boxes, but it'll come out right here somewhere, if you can get it right here. Um, that's what I'm hoping. But this joist space is open from the flues here. Okay, and then run the line set just outside along the wall. And then around the corner to the condensing unit right here. It'll sit on the cement pad, so no pad no. needed. Okay, while we're out here, look at the electrical. The electrician will run power from the inside breaker panel, which is just on this side, and then run half inch EMT along the brick line all the way down to the corner. Use an LB around the corner, then to a disconnect right here. Okay, let's go inside and look at the AC. Coil and things. Okay. So, here's the furnace and AC coil. in there so the drain just uh, will key into the existing drain recorder and strain pipe right there we give you 10 feet of PVC and put in you know our standard easy trap so here's those flues and we have this joist face open next to it so we also have an unfinished ceiling here in the kitchen so, we have this joist space next to the flues all open, which is where those two boxes were. Like one box is right here, another one's right there. I'm thinking we can get, come out right next to the other box right there. Run our flute or our line set out. Okay. Um, okay, so why we're here, our thermostat is a heating and cooling thermostat. Um, it's not wired for cooling right now. So you will need to wire it up for cooling. There are unused wires behind it. Okay, let's go look at the power. Okay, here's stairs. Come into the laundry room. Here's a storage room. Here is a GE panel. Okay. Anyway, so we'll come out of here with a 20 amp two pole GE breaker. Um, Romex up and out. And then where electrician will run conduit all the way to the end. Okay, and I believe that's about it.